Hey guys, Will from Destin. I'm North from Destin. We are at E3 2011. This is the Microsoft booth. We're gonna go play some Forza Motorsport 4. It's coming out this fall. Why are we playing Forza Norm? This version of Forza has Kinect head tracking. You can actually drive the car, move your head around, and it'll look around. You can look in the mirror, look out the window, um, and we're gonna try it out right now. Norm's taking off right now. He's uh, driving automatic, so no paddle shifters, and is aggressively powering through the pack. What he's feeling with the steering wheel is it's a little bit different motion than most force feedback feel wheels I've used in the past. You can feel the front wheels release uh, more than you do with a typical kind of rumble or bump steering wheel. And because it's affixed to the giant metal frame, that helps a whole lot. The head tracking is a pretty subtle effect, but it's really nice if you like to use the cockpit view. I, I typically don't use the cockpit view because you don't have enough of a field of vision, uh, so you can't anticipate turns. But in this case, it worked really, really well. Uh, so I was able to look to the left and kind of see a little bit about what was coming into the next turn uh, and, or what, what's off to my side and check out the side view mirrors even, which is pretty cool. Norman Chan shows no fear when driving someone else's virtual Ferrari. Drop the hammer, Norm. <laughs> so the effect was pretty subtle, but I thought quite good and actually made driving in the cockpit possible for somebody like me without a giant three screen you know, huge array in my living room. And they're on the standard setting right now. You can make it more adjustable, yeah. more sensitive um, when it comes out later this fall. Yeah, and I, I think the game's coming out in October. We were actually sitting in a Fanatec sled. It has 5.1 speakers. You hook a big monitor up to it. About $2,000. Yeah, it's expensive. And then there's also, there's a new Forza Fanatec wheel, right. which you liked a lot. Uh, really good force feedback. I thought the pedals were great. Right. And if you have the sled, the emergency brake is analog. So if you want to get into drifting and stuff like that, you can get a real experience, which is pretty cool. We're tested, I'm Will. I'm Norm. See you guys next time. Bye.